we're like, do you know what? We're ready to take you back. Europe might have other plans right now. <laughs> Talking to the Nightmare X. We're, <laughs> we're all going to get chucked out. Yeah, no, no, no. We're all going to get thrown out, out of the nightclub. Listen, it's been a great pleasure. Selma, Aisha, thank you very much indeed. That's it from us here in the swing room. People are starting to drift away. Do remember, uh, there's plenty of fact-checking on the website. The Verified team are working through what they've heard tonight. So go and have a look at that and all the clips there of the best bits of the debate as well. Thank you for watching. Uh, we'll hand you over to our BBC crews. Have a very good night. Tonight at 10, Rishi Sunak apologises for leaving the D-Day commemorations early. I returned home before the International Leaders' Event later in the day. On reflection, that was a mistake and I apologise. There was a chorus of disapproval for his actions at tonight's BBC election debate. Yes, good evening from the debate spin room. Yeah, there was universal criticism of the Prime Minister on the programme from the politicians tonight, including from a member of his own cabinet. And also on the programme, CCTV images emerge of the last sighting of the missing TV presenter Michael Mosley. The search for him continues in Greece. My one regret in terms of the, the tours that we've done is that I really, really should have come to play in Scotland more. That's Taylor Swift delights fans as she kicks off her UK tour in Edinburgh. And Iceland send a chill through England in their final friendly before the Euros. And on BBC London, a man who fought News back as a dog tried to move. And analysis from our team of correspondents in the UK and around the world. Hello, good evening. Rishi Sunak has apologised and said he made a mistake by leaving yesterday's D-Day ceremonies in France early. The Prime Minister attended a service commemorating British veterans, but then returned to London and recorded a television interview. Tonight, during the second TV debate of the election campaign, the Cabinet Minister Penny Mordaunt said Rishi Sunak had been completely wrong to leave when he did. Our political editor, Chris Mason, joins me from the debate spin room. Chris. Yeah, evening to you, Jane. So a septet of politicians for 90 minutes on a Friday night. I grant you it's not traditional weekend entertainment, but then again, there is an election on. Lots discussed and debated. We'll bring you the highlights on the programme tonight. And a keen reminder, too, that, yes, there's lots of focus in this campaign on the race to be Prime Minister, but there is a smorgasbord of options that voters will have in front of them, depending on